cargo ship grounded off the coast of New Zealand's North Island is listing more and more. Scores of containers the Reno was carrying have fallen overboard, and others are perched precariously as the angle of the ship's tilt gets steeper. A huge vertical crack has appeared in its side. Emergency response agency Maritime New Zealand describes it as a substantial structural failure and warns the ship's stern may break away. But the fuel leaking from the ship has been the biggest worry so far. This is going to potentially be New Zealand's worst maritime environmental disaster. Um, This is putting at risk the livelihoods of people in this area. On Papamoa Beach, a foul black slick has washed up on shore. Smells like an old greasy... um workshop in a garage or something. Officials predict the leak will get worse. Local residents are incensed. There's a lot of really angry people here, eh? Like... Already 200 seabirds have been found dead, and dozens of others are getting emergency treatment to remove oil from their feathers. Troops have joined the cleanup effort on the beaches. Maritime New Zealand says officially there are 20 teams working on that, and the agency predicts they'll have to deal with some 10,000 tons of sandy waste. There's been no word on why the ship crashed into a well-marked reef in calm weather back on October 5th. The Filipino captain is free on bail after appearing in court on a criminal charge over his operation of the vessel. His second officer will face a similar charge Thursday. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.